Welcome everyone to the Give Me More Pizza channel. I'm Alberto the Pizza Guy and today I'm in Woodbury, New Jersey where I will be trying out a pizza that's based on a movie that Pizza Hut is promoting. And that pizza that I'm talking about, that pizza is called The Big New Yorker. Let's go. Give me more pizza. Guys, I'm back. Give me more pizza. I burned the pizza guy. Well, you know I don't do one bite. I eat the whole slice. And guys, I just got my pie from Pizza Hut. And this pie is based on a new movie that's coming out, which is the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem. And that's going to be coming out next month in August. I was watching TV last night and I came across a commercial from Pizza Hut advertising this pizza with the turtles in it. And I said, you know what? It'd be awesome. It would be cool to do a review on this pizza. Um, and it looked pretty good. So I said, why not? Why not do a, a review? And um, like seeing it up close as the young lady was, was cutting it up. And when I was, I was filming, I said, you know what? I'm going to really enjoy this pizza. Um, so it's based on, like I said, the Ninja Turtles. We're going to go over the Ninja Turtles. Uh, what they're about and their weapons and things like that in a little bit. But um, listen, I'm hungry, guys. I can't wait to get a bite. I got my drink ready. So let's get in. This looks like a pizza that a Ninja Turtle definitely would love to eat. I mean, I've watched the Ninja Turtles as a kid growing up. I love the cartoons. Um, who remembers the, uh, the, the Nintendo game? That was hard as shit to play, wasn't it? I mean, there were some, uh, levels where I could not even, like, get through. But, uh, I did have fun playing it, uh, up until the point where I couldn't pass it. But, um, who remembers that game, guys? I know I do. Alright, I got my slice right here, guys. Let me show you up close and this pizza. I'm gonna tell you off the bat, guys, it's a little greasy. Look at this. A little greasy on the bottom. All right, but you know what? Typical uh, Ninja Turtle style pizza, greasy, 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 but all good. I'm gonna fold it, but I wanna show you really up close again. All right. I could talk shit about this pizza because it's Pizza Hut, their franchise, so it's not a mom and pop spot. So I'm not hurting anybody, so. All right, let me get the first bite, guys. Mm. Okay. Let me take this one pepperoni out. Pizza's good. You know, a little greasy. Didn't bring napkins, guys. But I do have some in the stash. I'll be getting those out in a second. Let me get another bite. It's been a while since I've had a Pizza Hut pizza. Um, the sauce is really good. I do like that. The pepperonis are very delicious. I do like that as well. But I just would have liked it not to be so greasy. That's, that's the only bad part about it. But it's still a good pizza. I like the crust. 
I like the way it is. It's nice and soft. Toasted on top. That part I do like. Let me put my pizza down for a second, guys. And let me grab some napkins. Okay. I know I have some here. I have more. So we're going to start with this one. All right. So, my drink of choice for today, for this review, is going to be a Mountain Dew. Being as though, like, you know, Ninja Turtles, the ooze is what, you know, got them to be who they who they are as, as far as mutants. So, secret of the ooze. Nice green uh, Mountain Dew drink here. Cheers. Good stuff. All right. Let me continue eating my slice here, guys. So let's go over some of the Ninja Turtles and their weapons. Let's start out with Raphael. Raphael is a hot-headed character with lots of strength and anger. Lots of it, guys. Uh, Master Splint Splinter, excuse me gave him a weapon called the Psy. And this weapon that I'm talking about is a defensive weapon, not an offensive weapon for combat. Um, the next Ninja Turtle is Mikey. Mikey uh, gets distracted and is basically like all over the place. And uh, Master Splin Splinter, excuse me, gave him uh, Nunchucks. Nunchucks takes a lot of focus to be in control of that weapon. So, with him being distracted and not focused, Master Splinter decided to give him a, a set of nunchucks so he can stay focused, stay focused, guys. The next one is, uh, the next turtle is Donatello. Donatello is tech savvy and is the more genius out of the four. Um, Master Splinter gave him a stick to make him more creative with very less um, work. So, you know, he, he'll use a stick and to make it more interesting when he uses it in, in combat. Um, the next one is Leonardo, who is compassionate and ethical. And that is why he's, he's the leader of the, of the group. And he's one of my favorites, definitely. Um, Master Splinter gave him the katanas, which are awesome. I love the katanas. Katanas are a very, very cool weapon. I like the katanas a whole lot. Also, Katana is my favorite character in the Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat games, guys. So that's the Ninja Turtles and their weapons, guys. I'm going to continue to eat my pizza here, guys. So let's go over some of the movies that have come out based on the Ninja Turtles. The first one was that came out was in 1990, uh, which was basically Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Then the second one came out, which was um, uh, Secret of the Ooze. That came out in 1991. I believe that was the one that Vanilla Ice came out and was like, Go Ninja, go Ninja, go. Who remembers that one? I know I do, definitely. Um, the third one came out, Teenage Mutant Ninja Tur Turtles 3. That one came out in 1993. That one, I didn't like. That one was like back in... Uh, Samurai times. I think they were like trying to do something where like they were going back to their roots or something like that But totally left field from the other two um, Then you have another one that came out in 2007. That was more of a cartoon based um, Ninja Turtle movie and then after that you had one that came out in 2016 Which I, I, I liked it that one that was more I think I, if I believe that was more of a CGI one um that wasn't like uh, the first three that came out where they had the men in the suits and things like that. This was more of a CGI one. Nonetheless, I liked it no matter what. I thought it was pretty cool. Um, and then you have another one that came out in 2022. Um, and then also the one that's going to be coming out this year in 2023 in August. So um, those are some of the movies. I know I'm sure there's like other ones that I didn't uh, touch on. But um, those are some of the movies. That were based on the Ninja Turtles. Alright guys. You know how I like to do. I like to break the crust in half guys. 
We're going to start out with this one here first. Get the bite. Very good crust, guys. Very good crust. Very, it is soft, but um, very well done. Alright guys, you know what time it is. Last bite. Done. The Big New Yorker, based on the Teenage Mutant Ninja movie, um, Mutant Mayhem that comes out next month at your local Pizza Hut. So you can grab one at your local Pizza Hut, wherever you may be. So, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that like button. And subscribe to my channel I'm also on Twitter and on Instagram or remember to keep saying give me more pizza and I'll catch you on the next one adios